Go on in and sit down and no peeping, please. Close your eyes nice and tight. I've got a surprise. Keep them shut. Open them. There you go. There he is. Your new little baby brother. What's wrong with him? He looks really funny. What do you mean, funny? All red and scrunched up. Oh, babies look like that when they've first been born. Don't forget, it's only five minutes old when that picture was took. How's Alison? Oh, she's OK, you know. She was practically asleep when I left. She must be shattered. You both must be. Yeah. She wants me to go for a drink after. I'll be falling asleep in my pint. When can we go and see the baby? Well, we should probably wait until tomorrow. Give Alison a chance to have a bit of a rest. Yeah, she should be up to visitors by then. Right, look, so I uh, better go. I want to phone my dad, tell him he's got a grandson. You always wanted a boy, Kevin. Remember you talking about it? I wanted all my kids, so still do. Right, you keep that one. Look after it, OK? Mwah. Mwah. See you later. Bye. See you. Jake like it. I'm sure he's going to love it. You're doing a great job. Now, we must remember to take this with us when we go and visit. Mum, where will Jake sleep? Well, at the moment, he's sleeping at the hospital. But soon, he'll be at Alison and your dad's house. And where can he come and stay? What, with us? Yeah. Well, yeah, I suppose he can come and stay with us when he gets a bit older. But, girls, you have to understand that Alison is Jake's mummy. And Jake belongs to her and your daddy, and he'll be living with them. That's not fair. Don't worry, Sophie. You'll see him lots of times. And you'll get lots of turns of pushing the pram. And I'm sure Alice will let you bath the baby and dress him. But it's not the same, is it? No, Rosie, it's not the same. It's not. 